Hello my dear students, so welcome in my video lecture. So as you all know, we are discussing the video series for class 12th and uh, that is for term 2. Okay, so in this video lecture, I am going to tell you about common cold and this topic I have taken from human health and diseases class 12th NCRT. So what exactly happens in common cold? Basically, it is a viral disease. Okay. It is a viral disease and uh, many viruses, they also cause disease in the human beings and like uh, rhinovirus, this will represent uh, such group of virus and which cause one of the most infectious human ailments like uh, common cold. This rhinovirus, it is going to cause one infectious disease which is known as common cold, okay. And they infect the nose and respiratory passage. What, uh, what uh, this virus will do, it will uh, infect nose, infect nose and uh, respiratory passage, nose and respiratory passage but not the lungs. Respiratory passage it will block but not the uh, lungs, okay, but not lungs. So, the common cold, uh, it is characterized by nasal congestion and discharge. So, some common symptoms for the common cold, I am telling you symptoms. Number one, the symptom it will be nasal congestion, nasal congestion, okay. And uh, number two, it is uh, nasal congestion and discharge, okay. And number two, it is uh, a sore throat sore throat okay and uh, next one is hoarseness hoarseness and uh, cough headache cough headache and tiredness cough headache and uh, tiredness okay and which usually lasts for 3 to 7 days this will occur for 3 to 7 days and droplets resulting from cough or sneezes of an infected person are either inhaled directly or transmitted through contaminated objects. Means you can say it is a droplet infection. If a contaminated person, if of any person, like droplet infection it is. So droplet resulting from cough or sneeze of an infected person are either inhaled directly or through transmitted through contaminated objects like uh, some contaminated objects may include pen, paper contaminated objects because it is uh, spreading with the help of droplets so some contamination will occur with the help of some contaminated objects objects like uh, pen book cups door knob okay computer keyboard mouse and cause infection in a healthy person so this is a common cold which is related and many other viral diseases are also there like uh, hepatitis viral disease, hepatitis infection, hepatitis is a, also a viral disease. Similarly, uh, like dengue, it is also a viral disease, chikungunya, okay, covid virus, coronavirus. These are also some viral diseases but uh, I have totally focused on this common cold because it is a to common topic for your board exams and it is given in the NCRT of class 12. So my next video lecture will be on human health and diseases topic and I will take malaria, malaria for the discussion and after that we will discuss uh, some small diseases like MABSS which is also known as elephantiasis or amoebic dysentery okay and uh, some more diseases we will discuss and after that we will come to the topic like immunity which is also very much important for your board examination and in my last video lecture i told you about pneumonia typhoid these are also diseases which are which are caused due to the bacteria and this disease it is caused by virus only so i have classified under this uh, viral diseases okay so these are also some more examples some more examples of viral diseases some more examples of viral diseases and it may include dengue chikungunya and uh, rabies also rabies is also one of the viral disease okay so this is all about the today's lecture uh, and i hope uh, this uh, common cold it is very clear to all of you if you feel any doubt you can write uh, or you can ask your uh, doubts okay Thank you very much.